everyone, and here's our devotional for Wednesday, May 23rd, 2018, entitled, A Positive Influence. Do not be conformed to this world, but be transformed, Romans 12, 2. I have found that the casual Christian has little or no influence for good upon others. Only the Christian who refuses to compromise in matters of honesty, integrity, and morality is, is bearing an effective witness for Christ. The casual worldly Christian is prepared to do as the world does and will condone practices that are dishonest and un ethical because he is afraid of the world's displeasure. He ignores the Bible's clear command, do not be conformed to this world. Only by a life of obedience to the voice of the Spirit, by a daily dying to self, by a full dedication to Christ and constant fellowship with Him, are we enabled to live a godly life and have a positive influence on this present ungodly world. Is the world changing you? Or are you changing the world? Hope for today. The early church turned the world upside down for Christ. They endured beatings, imprisonments, and death. How can we hope to change our world for Christ when we're afraid to take a stand or to stand out? Wow. You know, isn't that true? You know what? And if I would have read this 20 years ago, well, 25 years ago, you know, I would have been like, Oh, you know, that would have been a real conviction for me because I'm just going to get real here. Um, you know, um, I think most of the people who knew me all my life think that I was always a Christian and everything. Well, you know, I always believed in Jesus. I knew that he was the son of God. But in my teens and my young adult years, I wasn't willing to live for him. I was willing to do whatever came along, and if I was around Christians, well, I would be a Christian. If I was not, then I would not be. Um, I didn't do outward things that you would consider um, non... I mean, everybody was always like, well, you were always a Christian. Well, no, I really wasn't inside, you know, and you know, my words, I'm sure, didn't really portray a Christian. Um, So I kind of lived you know, a life that was not, I mean, it was up and down and back and forth. I was a casual Christian at the time. And, um, there was one day in particular. Now, I don't know if Mrs. Wilson listens to these, but I'll never forget this. Um, I was at, that was the, one of the, uh, the temporary, uh, time that I went to the blind school. Um, I had said, I had called somebody something that's not very nice, and she's like, and Mrs. Wilson comes up, and she's like, nice talk, Kelly, you know, and she was a Christian, and I always, you know, would act like a Christian, you know, with her and stuff, and that really convicted me, but of course, at that time, I wasn't ready to to change, but it's like, yeah, I don't want to be a lukewarm Christian. I want to be a strong Christian, and I want to be, to stand up for Jesus no matter what, and no matter who who I'm around, and in November on November 3rd of 94 well Jesus changed all that and he helped me to to um to really want to desire to be a real Christian so anyway enough rambling for me and may the Lord bless you all and be with you till tomorrow